First, remembering Wahid Bouzidi, a farewell to the talented comedian at 45. The world of comedy is greeting the loss of Franco-Algerian comedian Wahid Bouzidi, who rose to fame through the Jamal Comedy Club. Tragically, Bouzidi passed away at the age of 45 following a stroke that left him in critical condition. His departure leaves a void in the hearts of his fans and fellow comedians. After being hospitalized due to his stroke, Wahid Bouzidi's health rapidly deteriorated. He breathed his last on a Sunday, only days after being admitted to the hospital. The news of his passing was shared on his official Facebook page and confirmed by his press officer. It was revealed that Bouzidi suffered a stroke while vacationing in Morocco, where he remained in a coma until his unfortunate passing. Bouzidi's comedic journey gained prominence through the Jamal Comedy Club. His unique style and humor resonated with audiences, showcasing his immense talent. In addition to his stand-up success, he ventured into the world of cinema, making appearances in popular films. Notably, he graced the screen in movies like Kickback in 2015 and Encore Juryu in 2016, alongside renowned actors Sandrine Kitterlane and Edward Bear. His final one-man show, Wahid, He Gets Up, was met with acclaim, marking a triumphant chapter in his career. Puzidi's dedication to his craft and his ability to bring joy to countless lives will be remembered and cherished. Second, remembering Nancy Franjoan, a tribute to her impactful legacy at 70. The entertainment world mourns the loss of Nancy Franjoan, an accomplished actress celebrated for her compelling portrayals on daytime television. Best known for her role as the cunning villainess Cecile de Polignac on the NBC soap opera Another World, Franjoan's passing at the age of 70 leaves a void in the hearts of her admirers. Born in Barnstable, Massachusetts, Franjoan embarked on a successful career in daytime television. Her debut on All My Children introduced her as Tara Martin, a core member of the original teen cast. She later undertook the role of Cecile in 1980 on Another World captivating audiences with her portrayal of a complex character. Franjoan's talent extended to other notable roles, including a brief stint as Tana Roberts on One Life to Live. Her acting prowess stretched beyond daytime as she made appearances in primetime shows like Buck Rogers in the 25th Century, Matlock, Highway to Heaven, and The Nanny. Additionally, Franjoan ventured into the realm of TV movies, and he can grace Broadway stages, showcasing her versatility. Franjoan's legacy extends to her personal life as well. She shared her journey with her Another World co-star, Christopher Rich, with whom she was married from 1982 to 1996. Their bond resulted in a daughter named Mariel Rich. Her impact on television and the lives of those she touched will be remembered with fondness and gratitude. Third, reflecting on the legacy of James Levy a multi-talented writer and broadcaster. The world mourns the passing of James Levy, a British travel and humor writer, independent journalist, broadcaster, and editor. Born on December 9, 1947, Levy lived a life marked by creativity and storytelling until he passed away in August 2023 at the age of 75. Levy's journey encompassed diverse endeavors, from his contributions to the BBC Horizon program, we love cigarettes to his insightful works, such as The Herod's Pocket Guide to Find Cigars. He engaged with audiences through his writings for Cigar Journal and other publications, demonstrating his passion for sharing his expertise on smoking. His legacy also extended to the realm of broadcasting, where he lent his voice and insights to the public. His impact resonated with viewers and readers alike, making him a notable figure in his field. While the exact cause of Levy's passing remains undisclosed, his contributions to literature and broadcasting continue to leave a lasting impression. As the world remembers James Levy, his creativity, knowledge, and contributions will be cherished.